What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be talking to you about the baby products that I would buy again. If I really love something, I will buy it over and over and over again. These leggings, literally, I have six pairs of them. It's here to tell you about the baby products that I really, really love and I think that you would love them too. They helped make my life as a mommy way easier, tons of times. Like, just had a flashback right now. Let's just go ahead and get started. One of the first things that I want to tell you guys about, and you probably wouldn't even really think that it's that serious because, I don't know, whoever thought of that. Ankle socks. My baby, he has really chunky legs. Like, the circulation in his ankle was getting cut off. And I would literally have to roll down the sock to his ankle because it's the skinniest part of his leg. Um, so I decided to just look up on Amazon one day and ankle socks for babies and these came up. They came in like a 12 pack of striped and solids, different colors. Um, and they also have like the grip on the bottom. I really love these socks and I think they helped him out a lot too, just to feel more comfortable. So I highly recommend getting these. Okay, so the next thing I want to talk to you guys about is the car seat. Okay. So basically here I have my car seat and obviously it looks just like a regular freaking car seat because it is um, But what I want to talk to you about is the liner that I put in here basically this liner <laughs> Basically this liner is Kind of like a blanket without having to carry around a blanket. So let me show you how it works. So basically you can see how I just went ahead and zipped it in and this is basically just a cover that goes on top of that inner liner which is really nice because if you've ever hauled around a baby before then you know that usually you'll be hauling around a bunch of blankets too. This really eliminated the fact that I would have to remember to get a blanket or like always have to throw one over him because I already knew oh no we're good to go like car seats ready this thing that I have to show you is also for the car seat but this is actually just like a whole car seat cover this is what it looks like and it's like really thick it has a soft inner lining as if you're wearing like a hoodie and um it has a flap down as well so basically this goes over your car seat and I'll show you exactly how this works These button clasps just really help tighten everything up and like you can see there's hardly any gap there. It has these two zippers so if you want to you know, peek in on your baby you can do that. If it gets too hot I would just tuck it in. Okay so once you flip all of that over you don't have to worry about any bugs getting in here which is a huge thing for me because I hate, hate, hate hate flies so this lets me know that my baby's safe and not going to get touched by any disgusting things in the winter this was the reason why i would be able to go out so knowing that i had this car seat cover with the jj cole product on the inside um these are just like amazing i don't know hacks can you even call it that because this is just more like a necessity literally like this is the thing that i want to give people at baby showers <laughs> this car seat cover um and the insert because i just feel like they're so practical this is my utility cart that i ordered on amazon i ordered it in this really cute blue color and this is basically where i keep everything that i know i'm gonna be needing in the middle of the night or on a very frequent basis these are just some of the things that i have in here um swaddles and books for leandro to play with um this is a soft book i also really recommend getting these on here i just have the electronics and basically the charging devices to all of the baby electronics just basically um changing pads so you take these out with you i have one that i keep in his um diaper bag so i have these for the bed because sometimes you know things can get messy i almost let this product slip me by but this is called the cup catcher this is intended to it's a cup catcher it's intended to catch your cups um like sippy cups or bottles 
Um, it has this loop here. I use it to catch toys. This I feel has been really convenient because I caught myself washing dropped food. Okay, not food because he can't put food on here. But washing a dropped bottle. In this case, toys. Um, these are toys that he puts in his mouth. So obviously I don't want them on the floor. This has helped me um, from having to hand wash these and throw these in the washer every time it's just, you know, dropped or hits the ground. So totally recommend a cup cap. The next thing that I really have to put you guys on is this pumpkin butt. So this has been a lifesaver. This is a natural relief. It says natural pain relief to calm and soothe your child. And that's exactly what it does. Leandro started showing early signs of teething, like really hard to soothe him at times. Um, so I went ahead and ordered some of this because my sister recommended it to me. And you can get it just like this with a flat cap and um, you just like tilt it, put it on your finger and just like rub it on their gum. If you order the easy squeeze, you'll get a brush. If you order the other one, you just get the oil on its own. I would recommend getting the one with the brush. Just squeeze here, hand it to baby, boom, boom, boom. They take care of business on their own. You don't even have to sit there and do it for them. And then it's also really good for their fine motor skills. So definitely have to get some pumpkin butt. Another thing that I never really thought about until I had my own baby was to just make sure that I always carried around a canteen. Basically the whole reason for it being a canteen versus like any regular type of water bottle is the fact that um, one, you don't get like the chemicals and the all of the mess seeping in from the plastic if you leave it in like your hot car, but also the fact that it keeps the water warm is great. This insulated canteen will keep his water warm for an extended period of time. It's kind of more like a luxury, but he doesn't need to have warm water, but it's just nice for him to have warm water. So I keep one of these in the car seat or in the car seat. I keep one of these in the, what is that called? Diaper bag. I keep one of these in the diaper bag and I also keep one right next to the bed for those uh, middle of the night feedings. This is the Avent brand and basically it's a baby bottle warmer. When I was still breastfeeding, I used this all the time because I would pump and I would store the milk in the fridge. You just um, put the bottle in here with a little bit of milk and then you just turn the dial depending on how much, um, how filled your bottle is and it has a little label here to show you. And basically this is what I would use to warm up his bottles. Um, from expressed breast milk. It really just made things easier, because especially because I, I just feel weird about microwaves. I know that sounds weird, but I really just don't like microwaves. I use this still now um, with like a glass that fits in here um, and I'll warm up the baby food that I make him. So now I'll show you what I use to meal prep his food. Here. This is my baby Brezza. And I totally love this thing. I actually didn't know anything about this brand. Um, Jordan bought this while I was pregnant. I had no clue what he was talking about when he told me, oh, hey, I got a baby Brezza. He was like super excited about it. You open it up here, you put your food. This is where you put water, uh, which basically will be used to steam the food that you put in here. Either just blend if it's something that's already soft, like bananas or avocados, papaya. Um, and then, or you can steam and blend. Um, that's the option that I use most of the time when I'm making things with broccoli or carrots, sweet potato. Almost everything for me is steam and blend. Um, but this thing has been a lifesaver. I've, I've made tons of meal prepped food with him or for him with this. I have in my freezer right now, maybe like 70 meals for him. So I just like to keep food on deck for him. And this has really just helped me make it a lot easier to make sure that I have food done and ready. This is a need. Need, 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 need. On my you must have this for your baby list because it is a night light. This night light is actually, it has different settings on it. So you can see you just tap it with two fingers to turn it on and off. You can, this is full brightness, dim it down. This is still on. You can change the type of light. This is kind of like a, like a fluorescent light. This is like a warmer light. And then you have a really bright LED type of light. Basically, I keep this right next to the bed. Uh, very minimal dimness because Leandro is very sensitive to the light when he's sleeping. And 
I do need light to make his bottles. I really hope that you guys enjoyed all of, all of the products that I showed you today. I feel like these have really been impactful in my new life of motherhood. I will link all of the products in the description below. Just make sure to follow me on Instagram and newly on TikTok. Let me know if you have any products that you recommend for me to use or if you already are using any of these in your day-to-day -day routines. Um, go ahead, hit like, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Bye.